You are now listening to the Potato Squad podcast, where we talk about content updates, newly released items in the shop, and share some of our potato moments. What's up, guys? I'm Joe, a.k.a. Beard Daddy. I'm Christian, a.k.a. Steel Daddy. So, what are we talking about today, Christian? Talk to me. Honestly, I want to talk about season six, man. It's new. It's like, what, we're three days in, three, four days? Yep. Yeah, we're about What's your thoughts? Honestly, I love it so far. I really like what's going on with the map. I'm enjoying it. Your thoughts? It's awesome, dude. They lifted loot lake yeah it's no longer a lean lake it's literally flying around the map right now and moving to different locations i do i don't know if you saw yesterday actually it actually picked up one of the runes i did see that and there's like a hole in it right by pleasant i think is where Mm -hmm. it's at did it move from that location yet because i know it, it affected the ground uh it did affect the ground and last i played it's bouncy yeah it is bouncy too. it is I like that. And a little secret, I don't know if you picked up on this yet. If you go to the house, there's these little purple cubes around uh, the the floating house at Flute Lake on top of it. I did not see that. They just appeared after it picked up the rune. I have have not been up there since. Yeah, it's cool. That's pretty cool. So so I'll have to check this out uh, when we get some playtime in later. Yeah, I mean, that's really cool. So I like that those changes that are happening with the map, um, especially because it fe- mm-hmm. I feel like it's some kind of like taxi in a sense for the map. I don't know if that makes any sense. So I, ho- I feel yeah. like it helps you get to places faster and it gets the action going. So I do like that about the map. What about the skins? Oh, and, and the, f- the skins? Yeah. Uh, I just, the Battle Pass skins, I like them. Uh, so far, what's leaked in the store, I am not a big fan. Yeah. You know, I the battle pass. I, I love DJ Lo- y- Yonder. He, he's freaking amazing. He's a llama DJ. What else Dude, do I need to say? He's he is really dope. I really like his little satchel. He's got a little satchel that like lights up. His pants light up, and then the back. <laughs> the it's so weird, but it's like those minor details. And then how he's like wearing casually like some pink sneakers. Like what the heck is going on here? This guy's Dude, he does what he wants. He's DJ Yonder, bro. I understand. And then he looks all cool because he's all robotic. You know. He does. He's so freaking cool. And and that's only the tier one skin yeah. for buying the battle pass. Yeah. I, honestly, I would have been happy if this was the tier 100 skin and it had like a, upgradable things. But I love it. So I'm glad. I'd be 100% happy with that. If you could like change his face, kind of like what they did with the letdown of season four, a.k.a. the visitor. Uh, I love he had different faces, it, but... You know, the rest of the design was just meh. I, I I get they did something new, but I never I didn't think it was special. What did you, I mean, what I, you, I know the visitor has a soft spot in your heart. He does, bro. I'm looking at him right now. <laughs> uh, I like I said, I like where they were going with them, and I thought they would build upon that idea for the next uh, for season fives. Uh-huh. Uh road trip or unlockable skin from weekly challenges, but. They let us down, you know. I agree. I'm hoping actually this one's better. The path as a pathfinder. Yeah, What's his yeah. Name? Um, I'll t- oh, hunting party, hunting party, because uh, Senor Hockey Pads was just absolute <laughs> shit. You, you, I hated that skin. You know, I hated the bottom half of that skin with his fucking dickies, and he's got his little shin guards on, like he's about to prune some some shit in my garden, dude. And I'm just, I'm just not a fan of him. That's so fun. So that's so fun. Hunting. Hunting party, hoping it's better, needs to be better. If not, I'm going to be really disappointed in Fortnite because you let me down twice, you know. You know what, though? Shame on you. One more time, shame on me for even getting my hopes Okay, up. Okay, but with that said, what about the, what was it, season five uh, mystery? Mm-hmm. The mystery one or whatever the heck it was called? What, what was it? How did you feel about yeah, that the inf- the enforcer. That's what I was talking about. Oh. The hockey pads. Oh, the hockey pads. Okay, okay. Yeah, dude. That's what I was talking about. He's gonna like prune my garden with those freaking uh, shin guards. That is hilarious. That is is horrible, dude. I see. That's <laughs> what I'm saying. Like I, that one isn't even that bad. I think you're too overcritical, and you really like pay attention to all of it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I spent seven weeks doing these stupid ass challenges, and this is what you give me. Is anybody forcing you? I thought he looked kind of cool too. Yeah, his top half, yeah. But then he's got these like little baggy pants, which they literally stole from uh, Sledgehammer. It's 100% the same thing. They just reskinned it. 
I'm looking at it. I'm looking for a sledgehammer right now. That is Look at sledgehammer. He's wearing the stupid military boots. He's got the same baggy pants, same shin guards, different color, same thing. And, and you hate that dude too, huh? I hate him too for that, one of that very reasons. He's got these nasty-ass baggy pants. It works better for him because he's a soldier, but it does not work for – what is the enforcer? What is he? He's what is he, his, his backstory? Yeah. What is he? Yeah, he's a soldier from the future, bro. He's upgraded sledgehammer, bro. He's double sledgehammer. He's power sledgehammer, bro. Look at him. The power. Dude, he's fucking Walmart Robocop. He's the he is crap. He is the enforcer. You know, <laughs> the, the knockoff enforcer. Enforcer? <laughs> Was he French? Oof. <laughs> <laughs> oui. Enforcer. Ooh. Maybe it is. <laughs> <laughs> he's just a disappointment, dude. I just I expected more from him. All right. His back bling doesn't even match. What's with this riot shield? I'm sorry. <laughs> just what is it? I like it too, dude. The riot shield looks dope. I think it looks. Yeah, but it doesn't match him. What's with this color scheme? Red and black, and he's, you know, gray, and he's blue, and he's black. It does not match whatsoever. If it was blue and black, yes. You know, not, but no. Not everything has to be matchy-matchy, bro. Well, bro, if you're, if you're going to have a matching back bling, it's supposed to match the character. You know, that thing looks better on the ace skin than him. Heck, it looks better on Redline than him. It looks like it was made for those yeah, two skins. Yeah, but I think you're just looking at the accents or the, the, the color scheme. That's why. Well, you got to take it all into uh, account because this is a legendary skin. <laughs> this is the best of the best. This is the best Fortnite has to, to offer. Yeah. This is the equivalent of $20. Would I spend $20 on this? Fuck no. Okay. I wouldn't even wipe my ass with this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I really think Cloakstar should be a legendary skin then. Yes. I, I think Cloakstar, which was the little hidden gem of the finale of season five, is fantastic. He was a hidden gem. He should have been a legendary. They should have given him a back bling. He's so dope looking. I'm looking at everything that he has. Like right now, he's got the robot legs. The robot legs are awesome. The, he's got the he's slender figure. He's got the spiky arm pad. Yep, looking at it. He's got his arms or his hands wrapped in like some like boxing tape. Yeah. He's about to fuck some dude shit up. Yeah, dude. He's, fu- he's fantastic. He's my favorite skin right now. Favorite skin. Yeah, I agree. And then those shoes, it looks like he's rocking some like old school like Converse or some shit like that, like green with like yellow. They look dope. But the, mm-hmm. but like Kung Fu shoes. It's kind of weird. It's a weird mixture. I do like those shoes though. Dude, they're like the Shogun Airs or something like yeah, that, dude. Yeah, dude. You know? They're like the, the Shogun Fighter 4000s. Ooh, I like that. I like that. <laughs> yeah, I'd rock those. Right? Just slap some Supreme on it, bro. <laughs> oh, that's it. Quadruple. That's all you need. Quadruple the value. Two thousand bucks, easy. Uh, copper drop. Limited release. Copper drop. Instant cop. Instant, Instant cop. cop. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> the the calamity chick, I think she's pretty dope too, for a tier one. No, she's awesome. For a tier one, she's got a great character design. I like her upgradable styles. I do. I do like her. I like her whole upgrade. Every style looks better and better. I think she looks so dope. Plus the smoke at the end, just like, wow. And and you can have like an all black where it's subtle, which is really cool. Yeah. And you can edit the colors of the robe later on down the season. I believe that's part of the the weekly challenges, actually. It is. It is. It's uh, the Calamity one, and that's the one where you get the pickaxe. The pickaxe? Uh, what is that exactly? I, I haven't really gotten a good look at it. It looks like some kind of sledgehammer with a wood spike. Yeah, like a wood spike. It's like some haze maybe on it. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, it's like a wood spike. It's probably like a, a vampire hunter. So it looks like actually now that I think about it, maybe Calamity is uh, the slayer of that. What is that chick called? Dusk, I think is her name. Well, Dusk, if you look yeah, at her, 71. as soon as she upgrades, she kind of looks like Van Helsing. She does. Like a chick version of Van Helsing because she's got, you know, the duster. She's got the Van Helsing hat. She's got the bandana on her face. Everything. She's the chick. She goes from, you know, what's her name? Jessica Simpson and, like, uh, Dukes of Hazard to freaking Van Helsing, bro. She does, dude. Tell me I'm not wrong. She's got no, everything. No, Look at her. Yeah, Straight out of that movie. Yeah, dude. I'm checking her out. She looks cool, dude. I think she looks really cool. I like her. I like rocking her. I've honestly taken a few dubs with the skin, so even more. Yeah? Yeah. So I think you're slightly biased. I, I am very biased. <laughs> if I take dubs with that skin, I automatically feel like it's a skin and it's not me. And I know that's retarded, but that's like I feel like that's my vibe. It's a psychological it thing. Is. When you play this game, when you buy this skin, you feel like you're fucking rock star at this skin. Like when you whip out Galaxy skin 
or something like that, you know? It's your go-to scanner. Right now, it's probably either Calamity or Cloak Star. Cloak Star, Star bro. Cloak Star, yeah. Right now, well, since you're rocking Cloak Star, I'm down with that. But sometimes I'll do, I'll switch it up, you know, Calamity or Cloak Star right now. I uh, did it. There's, you know, I'm just, and also going back to the Cloak Star, once you get that tier 100, the, uh, the Dire, he's got that unlockable Katana. That oh looks like that God. could be his, you know, his legendary back bling oh that we've God. been waiting for. That back, that you know, they're like, they're like, maybe we should have given this guy. You know what? Fuck that, guys. I'm gonna put that as the tier 100 final unlockable of the season. It's perfect. Dude. We, know, we know, it's gonna look so good at that skin. We know skin collectors, and they're gonna get it. Oh, of course. But uh, what do you think about the other skins, dude? You know, we haven't really talked about. You know, we talked a little about dusk, and you know. She's kind of a ravagery skin, but I think done right. Yeah, I think she's I think she's cool. I really like her. Um, probably not my go-to skin. It's not, you know. And for it being, honestly, what, what is she, like a tier 71? She's a tier 71. I like her. I think she looks kind of cool. For a tier 71, she's worth it. If she uh, tier 80 something, eh, I'd be like, whatever. Yeah. Uh, but I, I do like her design. Yeah. You know, I think it's fresh. It's unique. But... The real, the the main thing about her I love is those wings. Yeah, those wings are. Sh- Let's talk about those wings, man. Dude, those wings. Straight fire. The dusk wings. Ooh. Oh my! I, I have them on my cloak star. Well, I don't have them on, but I'm trying them out on. Cloak love star. Ranger wings. Who? Right. I'm sorry. <sighs> these dude, nothing. I'm never gonna wear those anymore because you know these black dusk wings look good if any black colored skin. Yeah. I'm gonna put that on my clinical crosser, cloak star, Omega, John Wick. John, oh, I don't even have John Wick. That was before my time, <laughs> unfortunately. It's just anything black or a white skin, they're going to look fantastic on. Yeah, they will. You're right. You're right about that. And that's going to be in my heavy rotation. Yeah, heck yeah. Once I get that, I'm, I'm estimating probably by Thursday at least. Once the challenges come out, I'll have it unlocked because uh, I'm getting pretty close right now. I'll be probably uh, tier 48 tonight. Oh, nice. But, uh,. Yeah. Yeah, but I think seven more tiers, I believe, till I get that. So I'm pretty pumped for that, man. Me too. I agree. I'm the same way, dude. 100%. And now I'll be honest, though. And I know I always bring this up to you, but those mm-hmm. wings on Havoc would look amazing, too. But you're right. They would look good on Havoc. Dude, they're just so. Even I want to put them on. Uh, it's kind of weird, but uh, what's his name? Raptor? Wildcard. Oh, Wildcard, Wild dude. I think so. Let me see. Because you got the club's mask. Put the club's mask on. Got the all white, and you got the contrasting black wings. It's gonna look straight fire. Yeah, calling I'm it. I'm checking it out right now, actually, as we speak. But yeah, I think they've done good. You know, the one skin I oh man, that thing looks bad. He looks crazy. I told you, it looks so clean. Wow, it does look clean. It does look clean. I'm gonna post these up. On a- yeah, post some of these uh, skin combinations. You know, I think other people would be interested in what some of these skins look like since we have about 50 each. So. <laughs> right you know and but we got a good mix of things the one i the one that i think is dumb but cool at the same time though and i think i know which one you're talking about and this i was thinking about this this might be mm-hmm. my season six zoe it, the tomato chick nah, the giddy up bro Giddy up! No, Giddy up is amazing uh, are you kidding the, me get out of here that thing is trash giddy up is a short man on a magical, majestic, purple unicorn. Yeah. Llama corn. My bad. Yeah. Llama corn. Dude, it's got a special emote where it snorts, I mean, sniffs out glitter. It does. It does. What's better than that? I'm sorry. Uh, it's a, a secret emote. A lot of things. And have you have you seen those uh, those llama cheeks, man? He is thick. He is. He is. Yeah, dude. <laughs> I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm doing the emote right now, but glit- glitter up is what it's called. Oh, well, it's it's a total troll outfit. It is. You know, it's just it's just like oh, let's just rock this because it's funny. Yeah. I, I you know, but uh, it's a default on inflatable llama. It, it's whatever, dude. It's whatever. I do. It is what it is. Yeah. I don't know. Like I said, that, that's like I was thinking about. This is my season six, Zoe. I see. But I have fun rocking it, though. I don't mind if I get rocked by it because it's funny. <laughs> it's a default wearing a llama. Like it's, I was really hoping, though, that the it would be an editable style where you could add the, the llama to your character, any of your characters. That would be cool. Battle pass or... Uh, or or uh, item shopped. 
honestly, most of the skins are pretty good. Most of the stuff they release is pretty good. And uh, there's a lot of cool stuff out here. Like even that glider that has the wolf inside the pie. You know, it's funny. It, will I rock it? Probably not. But it's a cool design. I, I like where Epic's going. You know, it's they're no longer the days of the uh, default skin uh, or the basically reskin gliders right. that we've seen so much of. Yes, some of the Battle Pass ones are that, but then again, you get the carriage. It's like Dude. it has like this ghostly aura, and it like drops ammo everywhere. That's really cool. Yeah, I thought they're really going all out. The design. I thought that was or, a really cool one. Look at the uh, the tier seventy nine, dude. It's just like bat out of hell, literally. Yeah. It's got this like creepy ass haze and it screeches. It's the coolest looking glider. Sounding hell oh, no, I don't think God. it's annoying as shit. It is so annoying. I hate But damn is it straight fire, dude. That looks so great. It is dope. It does look dope. I just wish it didn't screech. If it didn't screech, I'd be so down with it. But because it's screeching. You know what you can do to that? Turn your vo- turn your volume off. <laughs> oh God, I don't care about it that much, but I see what you're I see where you're getting at with that. It looks cool, dude. It, it's only up in the air for a second. Your enemy knows you're coming. You're about to fuck shit up. That is. Sh- They're in for a bad day, my friend. It's like They're in oh for a bad day. man, I know exactly what that is. It's, it's tier seventy nine. Fuck. Yeah, it's like a, I'm only tier twenty four. It's fuck. it's like that. Uh, <laughs> what what is that? The servo. It's all it's like, damn it. Dude, that is a, an amazing d- design. It, Nothing is like the servo. It, it, Granted, yes, the uh, the audio on the that. Switch, the Switch did have one, so I can't say there's nothing like it because they did reskin it. Right. But that was the first of its glider design. There's nothing designed like the servo. Uh, yeah, nothing. There's not, and it's really dope. But once again, the audio is what's killing me. But fuck, is that thing loud, dude? There's like, oh my god, it's like a chainsaw. It's like, zing, ding, ding, yeah. ding, 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 basically, yeah. everywhere you go. Yeah, exactly. There are no sneaky landings with that glider, dude. No sneaky landings. There's not. Fuck, I can hear you from six mountains away, dude. And that's what I don't like about it. Once again, I get it. Like, I guess if we're pro, then I understand. But we got to use the element of surprise, bro. <laughs> we ain't no pros, bro. Yeah. But. No, we're no pros, anyways, dude. Let's be real here. Overall. I, I I like season six. I'm enjoying so what this. It. What other uh, skins do you like? What do you think about the uh, the red riding hood, which uh, we both unlocked yesterday? I like it. What are your thoughts on I that? I like it. I think she looks cool. Once again, the design, the the everything about her looks really cool. You know, the details, how she's got daggers. She's got two wolf's tails on her other side. She's got a little coin mm-hmm. purse hanging out. Everything looks pretty cool. She looks like like gothic in a sense, but... You can't mess with this red riding hood, bro. You can tell, dude. She's killed the wolf. Yeah. You know, his tail is there, dude. Many, is she... many of them. Because apparently she's got one tail in the pie and then two in her hand. Yeah, bro. She's here to fuck shit up. And and I'm just saying, I'm not going to be biased, but I did take a dub with this skin mm-hmm. earlier. Really? On, on uh, mobile. S- whatever <laughs> I, I, I mean <laughs> like i told you sometimes i'm slightly biased because of that you know yeah but uh, I, I don't know i just i just i like the skin but i don't love the skin uh, but the cape is cool cape is cool i, lo- I love how like the, the cape goes with it really well yeah but I'll, i don't like the patches though. i don't know i don't know maybe i'm being a little picky but i just don't like the patches on the cape. yeah what's up with that how come you don't like that I don't know, man. I just want it to be clean and streamlined. But then again, it goes for character design. Her sleeve is ripped. She's seen some shit. She's here to fuck shit up. You know, I get it. Yeah, why would she? So it does go with her. So it's like, why would she have a pristine cape, you know? She's got an impeccable fashion sense. No, I'm going to rock that. And takes care of her accessories. I'm going to rock that. I don't know. I'm going to rock that skin tonight. Just, just. I bet you are. Just because of that. So let's see. What else do we have uh, released this season? We talked about the dusk. Uh, What's her name? The tomato chick. What, what, What is that? I don't, I don't know, man. Is, she looks. Is that Fate Two Point or Tomato Point What is that? I think it's if if Tomato went back and had a child with Fate. This is it. This is Fate and Tomato's child. This is a love child. I don't like it. You know, I like a lot of it, but I just hate the face. I'm sorry. I know it's supposed to be derpy, but like, I feel like it's ruined. I feel like they should have done like a jack o' lantern face. Hmm. A jack and lantern face you, would have that been would dope. have been that would have been dope. Like, 
that would have been great. But that follows and no that w- story or no nothing. I don't know. We haven't seen any new cutscenes from this season or new events, so maybe it could follow something, dude. What does Tomato Chick have to do with the storyline? Hey, but seriously, bro, her cape is amazing. Nightclub. Her cape is amazing. Oh, my God. That gold and black combo with a tattered look, amazing. I can't wait. I love that design. I can't wait to rock that with Cloak Star, bro. Oh, for sure. Oh my. It's going to be a great combo, dude. Oh my. Gold, it's already gold and black. He's just adding another accent piece to it. So it's perfect, right? dude. Right? I, I can't. Like I said. But what about... Uh, I don't know. What about your boy, Dyer? How are you feeling about Dyer? Dyer, my, you know, peace day resistance, my f- season finale. I don't know yet. You know, I, I've seen it in game. I just... I, I don't know how to feel about it. I've never seen the max one in game yet. Obviously, because it's day three. Then again, there could be someone out there with 200,000, 250,000 EXP. I don't know. I'm not here to judge. Right. But uh, so far, it's just mad for me. I just feel like I was expecting something really cool, really badass, and mm-hmm. I'm stuck with Dyer. Yeah. And, and Dyer's not bad. It's just like some kind of teen wolf mixed with Michael Jackson and you know Van Helsing. You know, somebody told me that he looked like the Karate Kid. And <laughs> he does, dude. He looks like one of the characters from the car. Like, he'd be in an 80s movie, bro. Yeah. Oh, of course. Well, I think that's kind of the, the, the vibe I'm getting from him. He's some kind of... I don't... What is the main, the skin? The, the, the base skin. What do you think he looks like? What do you think he is besides Karate Man? And then the other thing is his... I think he looks like he's straight out Street Fighter, dude. That... I'm waiting for a fucking Hadouken. <laughs> I don't think he looks that cool. You know why? I don't think he looks that cool. His face looks derpy. He's like a default... Like, he's a default trying to pass off as a tier 100. That's how I feel that skin is. I think it's Tfue's final evolution, dude. That does look like that guy. <laughs> he straight up looks like the... Uh, I think the character's name is Jones. From where? I think, right? From where? From uh, the default's name from Save the World. That looks That looks just like it. I don't even remember. I don't pay attention to that game. I think it's... I think that's the name of the default, and uh, it's it's the basic default to blonde hair. It looks dead on. It's a disappointment. <laughs> it's default karate clothes. Yeah. Need I say more? Yeah, it's whack. But the back bling, the back bling that you get out of that? Oh, yeah. Oh, like I said, that's the only reason I want want it, mm-hmm. is so I can get that for my clo- my man Cloak Star. Yeah. It, it, it's the perfect pairing. I, it's, it's, that's... Probably all rock with him for a while. I, I can't say forever because I'm sure something cool will come out in the store. Right. Like, you know, this season, uh, I'm hoping Gold Trooper comes back. Or Skull Trooper. Skull Trooper. And, bro. uh. Skull Trooper. Oh. Um, the Reaper pickaxe. My God, dude. Skull Trooper would be so fire. I'm I, honestly, like I told you. Skull and Gold Trooper. I'm hoping both come out. Right. But I told you, I started playing because of Skull Trooper. Like, I wanted to play as that character and then didn't realize that I couldn't pick that character. And I've been checking the item shop every day. Are they coming back? Did the uh, little intro to season six hint at that? I feel. Did the battle pass hint at that? What are your thoughts? I, I feel like it did. I feel Skull Trooper more than Gold Trooper, obviously, uh, for a few reasons. Like you said, the intro video, I mean, he's in it, bro. And he's a troll skin. He's that personality that I told you that I like about skins. I feel like those skins are, are the ones I like. I mm-hmm. feel like he's going to drop because of that. And then you were saying, what else? The battle pass? You were telling me that there's a... It's hinted in one of the higher tiers. I think it is actually tier 82, where there is a Skull Trooper banner yep. Yep. icon. 82. I, if that's not another hint, I don't know what is. You know, they're basically saying, look, this is going to be in the item shop like they did last season with the shark with the laser beam with the other characters they were all hinted at with the sprays or emoticons in the battle pass it's funny because i'm thinking about it and what if it doesn't drop till halloween bro i'm okay with that you know dude that's only four weeks away i don't know man every tuesday every thursday every saturday and sunday i'm checking the shop bro (laughs) It's it's okay, dude. You're still gonna get all these new skins to come that come along the shop. If they're good, I don't know. So far, they've not been so hot, you know. But if they have the Gold Trooper, Skull Trooper, and the Reaper Pickaxe, mostly I really just want the Reaper Pickaxe. 
I think it is the cleanest pickaxe in the game. I will rock that no matter what season it is, no matter what skin I have. You want to bet you won't? It will be my default pickaxe. I, I feel like you're going to change. You're going to change on that. I've always wanted that. That's the that's that's yeah. basically the the skull trooper for you. The reaper pickaxe is to okay. Me. Reaper, it's something I've always wanted. Okay, reaper. Even even if it wasn't rare, I would always rock that. Okay, but reaper pickaxe or or gold trooper. Reaper pickaxe, dude. Hundred percent. What? I I like Ghoul Trooper and I like Skull Trooper. Are they cool? Yeah. Would I rock them a bit? Hell yes, I would. Now, there's plenty of combos I could do with them, but I've always wanted the Reaper Pickaxe. I think it's super clean. I can put it with like any skin, and it's it's what I like is the clean part. And it's just not bulky, and it's the loudest fucking thing in the game. Yeah. I want someone to know I'm wailing at these fucking trees when I got this thing, dude. Yeah. It. I want people to know for miles. It, it is it is a cool it is a cool pickaxe. I agree with it. That's why I like the cliffhanger. I know. I ring this up every time. Cliffhanger is the best cro- cop that you told me. It, it's it's super clean. It's like the, one of the most basic looking pickaxes, and it sounds amazing. Yeah, I, I agree. I love everything about it. It's it's something I slept on until I think what two weeks ago. Then I saw it in the store, and I'm like, oh, this is kind of yeah. cool. Buy it. Start swinging around. This sounds awesome. This thing looks awesome. Yeah. Not and now I rock it with almost every combination I do right yeah, now. Yeah, I can't stop. I can't stop using it to be honest. I, I dig it a lot. I knew you would, because dude, we have most of the skins we have are pretty much the same. Would you I, agree? I agree. For the most part, yeah. Besides some of the rares and you know, some of the uncommons, which for some reason I have a soft spot in my heart for. Who you knows do. Why? I don't understand why. I don't know. I, I like to throw them in my rotation every so often, just mix things up a bit. I can see that. I can see that. You know. Yeah. Besides Ghoul and Skull, which which um, may or may not come out. If they are, there's going to be hype this entire month about it, no matter what. Oh. Uh, Go ahead. What do you think about the leak stuff? What leak stuff are you talking about? Are the ones that were just released, my bad. The, the aviation I hate those. people. Those are trash. Straight duty. I think they're the worst. But, you know, I like where Epic's going with the rare skins now have backpacks. Yeah. Do I love them? No. They're trash. No, not They're at 100% all. percent trash. I, I, I They're trash. I, I don't know. I can't. I, even just because something, Four out of ten. Four just out of ten. something's a good deal doesn't mean I'm going to cop a good deal. If I'm not digging the deal. That's why I give it a four, dude, because it comes with the backpack. You're being, you're being nice. I give them a straight doo-doo one. Sorry. <laughs> doo doo one, not even a one, a doo doo yeah, one. one, bro. Those are probably like that, those are worse than the detective skins. Take that, yeah, they are. Back. Yeah, they, dude, <laughs> I feel like those skins. Are you ready? I'm not. You're shitting on my girl no. Gumshoe. How dare you? They're Fuck worse, out my face. <laughs> they're worse than Valor and Zoe, bro. That's how bad. That's how do I feel. Like Valor and Zoe. <laughs> <laughs> at least have some kind of like coolness to them some kind of originality <laughs> i'm sorry that just oh my to god me. worse than I don't zoe think I expressed to you why are you so triggered okay check this though is it worse than carbide yeah yeah i swear Bullshit. i Bull swear fucking shit. i swear i'd rather brought carbide a thousand times better than those stupid looking skins <laughs> what yeah. No way. Get out of town, dude. Carbide is the worst. No, carbide, you can change the colors of the lights. You can do a little a little bit of customization. I get the superheroes thing. It wasn't my skin. Trust me. You know that. Dude, you shit on that skin since season four. Get yeah. out of here. You hated yeah, that did. skin. I did. You straight yep. shit on that skin, yep. dude. And this is why I'm telling you what I'm telling you. You continuously, continuously shit on that skin. All the time. Even when you're like, oh, look, I got the colors. I don't care about the stupid colors. It looks dumb. Did your bitch ass even get the colors? I did get the colors. What, what level did you get season four? Like 65. 65. Probably just like 65. got the colors. Yeah, 65, 66. So you're just like, I got uh, the no, colors, no, no, guys. No, no, no. I got to level 69. I remember that because I remember specifically saying that. Yeah. Yeah. I did. So your bitch ass didn't get uh, Glowy Omega, though disappointment disappointment you know omega's dope i love it the glowiness i don't know i i do kind of like the basic form of it with the lights yeah i i like to rock the uh the basic with the yeah. purple lights 
That is one of my favorite skins I, in the game. I can see that, and I can appreciate that. And, you know, it, it's a cool thing of accomplishment. You're like, hey, guys, I got to tier level 80. I didn't have a life for this season. Yet I got a reward for not having a life. And I'm kind of sad that Fortnite got away with that thing that makes, you know, achieving the uh, max tier skin and getting to a level only people who dedicated themselves to the game can get. Because last season they did away with that. Enough people whined and they gave you Ragnarok with the customizable forms, kind of like Omega, but you could play with it until this season. And this season, uh, Fortnite just said fuck everything, and we're like, you know what? Let's let's have the requirements. Yeah, yeah, I agree with that. But just going back to Dyer is one of the reasons why it's not one of my favorite yeah, skins. I agree, Dyer. The I I guess is why I liked your boy the Visitor a lot. It was because you had to do the seven challenge weeks or the seven complete weeks in order for you to get it. Not every. Well, you got that for Enforcer yeah, too, right. buddy. And you're going to get that for and the new skin why, this season. You know what? They're kind of cool for that, you know, for that same reason. Like, you know what? It is kind of ugly. I get it. I'm being a nitpicky little bitch. Kind of? It is ugly. There ain't no fucking kind of here. I don't know, dude. I don't know. But, you know, enough of the visitor skin and after Enforcer, you know. About to eat some dinner, and I don't want to think about that shit. <laughs> All righty, but uh, where do you think the season's gonna go? We, you know, we talked about the skins. You know, so far in the shop has been just a complete trash. and utter letdown. It's total trash. I don't know if this is what season six has. Season six store has in store for us. Fuck it. I'm sorry, have, but you know, we can only go up from here. Having we can only go up in the season. I'll tell you that much. Is that is that only the only skins that come out though? Yeah. No, they had this like little fucking uh, like uh, October. Oh, those are so out. stupid too. Oh my god, those are trash too. Oh, the uh, October Fest girl with that guy. Don't get me wrong. I, hey, I'm doo-doo. down with somebody with the beard, and I'm down with beards. But that guy was just trash too. Straight trash. Oh, he's horrible, dude. I just thought it was like a mad design. I'm just like, I get it, you know, October Fest, October, whatever. I like beer. I like this. I like beards, but you know. Um, it's. I'm sure some people like it, but it's. It's not for yeah. me. Hard pass. Yeah, me too. I give them a four. But it's week one. But it's a four. Yeah, I get a four. But it's week one though. So there's there's plenty more in store for us. I'm sure there's gonna be a lot. Oh, cool those shit scarecrow that's skins out. too. Remember the ones that were in the. Oh, I forgot. Once you. Uh, when you finish the uh, all the challenges for week one. Yeah, and you, and it shows yep. the hidden battle yeah. star. Yeah, yeah, that was straight fire, dude. I will rock those Instacop if they're in the. Uh, I'm sure they'll be in the store. Um, but here's the thing, though. As much as I, I do say I want to cop it, I feel like it's basically a reskin version of Ravage, and I think it's. Uh, yeah, I do. I Raven, look at him. I, you know, it looks very similar. The character design, everything about it. The only thing they changed mm-hmm. is the color scheme. I agree with that, dude. I 100% agree with that. It's. The color scheme is just – that's what I'm saying. I got to be able to see up close, like the bottom, the feet and all that and see if they got lazy with it or if they actually tried, you know? You know you love this fucking elf boots. Don't lie to me, boy. That's why I didn't cop the raven. <laughs> that's why I didn't cop the raven. You're wearing some right now. Wear, You're wearing some right now. I wear those to Fuck bed. Fuck my face. <laughs> so I know you do. So when I'm scared, I grab the pointy <laughs> part and cuddle with it. Hey, man. Protects your that's feet from I, demons. That's, what I, that's why I wear it. <laughs> but, but uh real talk though where do you think this season's gonna go what do you think they're gonna do differently uh do you think it's just gonna be a rotating map or do you think they're gonna go full bore into this halloween theme and it's gonna change right before uh season seven which will be during i Christmas think that's time. exactly what's gonna happen they're gonna keep this dark halloween theme this like war torn place you know and then like you said once I um, mean, you know, Christmas comes around Christmas time. It's going to look a little bit more lively, mm-hmm. but that's why it's got time. That's why the room, yeah. the cubes got time to go around to each one of the runes and lift all the shit and destroy the map and, you know, cause some havoc around, you know, and there's going to be themed skins that are going to you know, be released around that. I'm really hoping it changes the map a lot. I really want it to, you know, cause we've, we've had the same Fortnite map for how long? It's there are a few changes, but it's it's relatively been the yeah. same exact thing. Yep, I am excited I for we'll where see. the season's going, though. I am excited to see other skins, and honestly, for my gameplay to improve. 
Super excited about the season. Super excited about the uh, Scarecrow skins. Hopefully they're better than Aviation I and so Oktoberfest. But enough talk, man. About to get on to Fortnite. Let's run some. Get you on there later, bro. Catch you guys later. If you guys enjoyed this, please give us a review. Uh, we'd appreciate it. This is our first one. Um, tell us if, what you think about the format. And uh, check out our social medias. We're going to start popping them off pretty soon. Uh, the Potato Squad podcast is our Instagram page. And uh, hit us up on Twitter, too. I think that's it, too, I believe. I will leave it in the description, guys. Anything else, Christian? I think that's it. All right, guys. Well, it was nice. I hope you guys enjoyed it. All right. See you guys Thursday.